Your eyes are useless when the mind is blind. This is a quote that really signifies the game Ian's Eyes, which is what we're going to be looking at today. Hi there, I'm Tot or Tales of Taylor for Long, and on today's adventure, we're going to dive deep into Ian's Eyes. Without further ado, let's just get right into it. You are North, the faithful canine best friend of young elementary student Ian, who's starting his first day of school. Ian is blind. Oh, I forgot to mention that, sorry. Your job is to be Ian's eyes. All right, now we're here at the school, let's go meet the principal. You must be Ian. Welcome to Blue No Home Primary School. I'm Mr. Bates, principal of the school. Whoa, that's some uh, shoddy voice acting right there. Oh, but, but you know what, I'll forgive it since uh, he kind of reminds me of some of my favorite gnomes. After a short exploration of the school, we're told to go to the gym. Let's go, North. Let's search for a place to stand. Mm -hmm. There are slides that show how the school was like at that time. Oh, it looks like a slideshow is happening. I wouldn't expect anything less from the 1980s. Wait. Wait, what? What is this? Uh, okay. What's going on, North? I want to get out of here. I'm scared. So uh, apparently, after the children were subjected to a certain slideshow, they became zombies? <laughs> and Ian knows something bad is happening, so it's up to you, North, to protect him. This is where the game truly starts, and where the game mechanics start to show themselves. The zombies don't have the best eyesight, but you get too close and you are dead. Whether North dies or Ian dies, you get a game over. No health bar or anything. You can separate yourself from Ian, run, crouch, and bark to alert zombies to your location. Be careful though when barking because you can actually alert Ian to yourself as well. Alone as the dog, you can't open doors, but with Ian you can. So there's no like running around without Ian on your own here. Also, being away from Ian for too long is bad. He frightens really easily, so if you're not there to make him feel safe, he will literally get scared to death. Lit literally. L literally. Literally. Now that that's out of the way, what's this game all about? Survival and escape. We gotta get out of the school. So we go from point A to B in an attempt to find an exit. And while keeping Ian and ourselves safe from zombie hordes. And we do that by distracting them, dodging them, etc. The gameplay while dealing with zombies can be a little bit trivial. It's all about patience and waiting for the right moment, and sometimes even luck. Your worst enemy in this game is bugs, things not working a specific way, and the worst of all, the camera angles. When traversing in a part of the map, it jump cuts you to the next area, and you can't see that next area until you're in it. Sometimes you end up dying instantly controlling North or walking with Ian during this confusing and frustrating transition. I can't tell you how many times I was running away from a zombie or two, and the camera changes on me instantly, and I have to change the direction that I'm going. I could be going left and boom, now I'm suddenly going down. So now I have to fix the direction pad and fix where I'm going on the controller and it's just a confusing mess. The concept for this game is really, really cool. I love the idea behind it, but it's not complete. The bugs, glitches, terrible camera angles, the storyline, the shoddy voice performances make this potentially amazing game into something subpar. Throughout your attempt to escape, you end up finding these hidden tapes. Well, they're not so hidden, but you find some tapes. A tape! Luckily, I never forget my cassette player! June the 17th, 1987. Damn bastards. And these are voice recordings of the principal stating that he was being fired, that he created the zombies, that he actually had a puppy for some reason, and he knows about Ian's arrival. You start to learn more about the principal and his backstory and things. Ian trusts the principal. I've been watching the cameras. We have two possible getaways. We can get out using the emergency exit at the cafeteria. The other option is to use the gym exit. We better use the gym exit. There, we can take the slides and destroy them. Do you think that was the reason that everyone went crazy? Uh, uh, uh. Mr. Bates! I'm sorry, I, I can't. Mr. Bates, please stand up! We need to get out of here! No! 
Mr. Bates, don't worry. We'll go to the gym and destroy the slides, and this nightmare will come to an end soon. And now he's dead. Ian, heartbroken, decides to get the slides to destroy them so no one else can be zombified, and then he's gonna escape with his faithful best friend, North. And then we can take the slides and destroy them. That's right! Let's take the slides before we go. We should go to the cafeteria exit. I'm sure it will be open. Now we're going from point A to point B, and man, the last stretches of this game are excruciatingly hard. I died over 500 times. And that's, that's not an exaggeration, guys. It counts how many times you die. But anyways, hey, you know what? Now we're here. We are here. The final stretch. The exit after all this time. We made it. Now it may seem like not that long to you, but this was quite trivial for me. We did it, North! Ian? Oh. Mr. Bates? You're what? alive! What's that? What? Indeed. Long the principal's school. alive? That's kind of a, I did. an odd I have them right twist. Here. Okay. We can finally He's alive. go home! Sorry, Ian, but I'm afraid I can't let you go. What do you mean you can't let me go? Nothing personal, but you know too much, so I cannot let you go. You're wrong! North and I will get out of here whether you like it or not! That is what you think! <whistles> North, come here, buddy! He is very and good. My grandson loved North him too much. is North? his dog. Let's go, buddy. Okay. Bark, North. <laughs> ever betray me don't don't you ever betray me I swear, I swear to god sunshine I swear <laughs> I can't be mad at you I can't be mad at you I uh I give this game two damn bastards out of five have a good smile for no reason and I will see you guys in the next video That was the end?